Ah. Yeah. Ah. Okay. Natoka mta naenda mitaani leo kalesa kesho train ama ndai kutoka kona zote za naa hii 254 majuu na jam paka saa hii unaielewa basi we njo kuja hapa ukupe maono kani formation so ama juu ya players toa pia prediction na banda KPL kuna hadi PSL League 1 Bundesliga PL matona zote na michezo zote hapa ndio platform basi tujibambe pale social subscribe like na ufollow drop pia comment pale whatsapp jo hapa ndipo na sasa analyst wa mtaa ndio full stop ah Naje naje hope mko poa siku imefika leo ndio leo leo ndio kusema eh analyst wa mtaa we are back in business mazi tumekuwa away for some time but tumerudi eh analyst wa mtaa ndio sisi kama vipi na leo mazi big day season inaanza leo uh, premier league tunataka kubonga juu ya few things and as always hii season vitu zinabadilika vitu zinabadilika eh tunaanza na news Community Shield ilichezwa last weekend eh Arsenal versus Manchester City eh, very good game eh, regular time ikaisha 1-1 though aliongeza karibu minutes 12 mm. na Trossard aka equalize in the last minute wakaenda okay, mapena Arsenal wakashinda eh walifunga 4 na City I think walifunga bao moja tu so kudos to them for making the first trophy of the season the Community Shield eh so wamepiga kelele lakini mzee kuna mse aliongea eh mtu msikize three in a row we lost three in a row yeah do you know why no. we won the premier league no, hai pep 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 ako na ubaya pep ako na ubaya mbe pep amesema ndio walishindwa three community shields in a row lakini walishinda the premier league no sana eh washaanza banta mapema mapema <laughs> so kudos to arsenal walishinda the community shield haya ya pili transfers big transfers maze all over na emergency ya eh, saudi league pia na stua juu wase wengi sana wameenda huko what do you think will saudi league be a threat to football or will it be Please help with growth in football. Please share your comments up with or down kwa comments. I appreciate sana sana sana. Na tunaweza bonga juu some of the transfers that have happened. Uh Declan Rice ameenda Arsenal, eh yeah. Messi ameenda Inter Miami, Kante ameenda Al Ittihad, eh yeah. Hoyland amejoin Manchester United, Nkunku ametoka Germany amekuja Chelsea, eh yeah. Kovacic ametoka Chelsea ame City eh Zaha Arsenal walitaka uplayer sana. Lakini Zaha ametoka ameishia wapi? Eh Galatasaray very interesting hiyo. Ah uh, Milner Mazeu mse atawai retire. Ameenda Brighton ametoka Liverpool. Eh Madison ameenda Leicester. I really thought I'd end United. Uh, I think chances za ku play aliona atapata pale Tottenham so akaishia Tottenham. Bellingham to Real Madrid kutoka Dortmund big signing very good player I'm able to choose England kabisa very smart move according to me eh Mane mzee ametoka Bayern Munich ameenda team inaitwa Al Nasser atakuwa anacheza na Ronaldo huko hivyo eh very big one Pia Henderson captain wa Liverpool ametoka ameshapoteza na team inaitwa Al Etifak hmm? eh Timba ameingia Arsenal Havertz and Arsenal eh, Aspila Quetta captain wa Chelsea very surprising ameenda Atletico Madrid I think Gomsal ni, ni legend pale Chelsea lakini ameishia anyway Ashley Young amekataa kuzeeka ametoka Aston Villa ameishia wapi Everton eh Mahrez ameacha City ameenda Al Ahly eh Gundogan ametoka City ameenda wapi Barca eh hmm? eh Ngine mwa mwenye kati ya mazeni Alan Saint Maxima wanapenda u player sana pale hiyo 
Newcastle la metoka Mwenda api eh, Al Ahli eh, Kwevo Saudi ah, The biggest one obviously eh, Ballon d'Or winner Karim Benzema La metoka na mwenda Al Itihad Mazi ya takwa jizogu yungu na kante Noma sana Hizo ndo some of the big moves that's gonna happen Gani meku surprise Gani unafikiri itakuwa big move Gani unafikiri ita Kwa na impact this season Share comment zako, share feedback yako Tuta appreciate sana Ehe Aya Predictions Mwibonga na nini Na metupatia feedback yenyu On who and What you think will be the top 4 Ya Premier League next season Ndo hizi hapa prediction Zenu Ajama jama Prediction yangu ya top 4 Premier League this season Ya kwanza ni number Ya kwanza ni eka Sinali Number 2 ni eka Man City Number 3 ni eka Ni eka Manchester Alafu number 4 sasa kuna Newcastle Kuna Chelsea na kuna Liverpool Hapu itakuwa Hapu itakuwa ngore Mina se nasema Arsenal number 1 kwa sababu gani last season tuli tulionyeshana kwa tuna tunaweza chukua hii league so na imeka Arsenal kuna na the new signings yenye tumefanya na juu ita to boost itatusaidia sana alafu na ile tactic na ile tactic ambayo Mikel amekuja nayo imekuwa poa imekuwa solid wachezaji wana wana link up vizuri so This season itakuwa itakuwa ngori sana. Eh? This season itakuwa ngori sana. Number 2 Man City najua mengangana so najua la season walipata competition na kachukua ligi lakini this season tunataka tuambie hakuna kikombe ambao atawatachukua. Round hii itakuwa ngori sana. Number 3 naweka Manchester last time walingangana this time the season pata watajaribu at least to prove what wrong uh, they, they, can, they can do it watupate competition na hiyo ndio kitu nataka wacha wacha kuje tumenyane pale juu eh? kwa hiyo pale fara, pale farasi itakuwa ni for, uh, this season itakuwa ndio hivyo hiyo ndio prediction yangu ya top 4 premier league na wacha tuone vile itakuwa but team zote timu zote ziko poa zimeje prepare vizuri na i hope ita italeta italeta msisimuko eh vile Fred Roche wanasema team nejaga eh team nejaga yani kama kama team ni nzuri nzu kama team ni mzuri ni mzuri eh so guys watch out for this season premier league I'm your boy, Wanchuari. But I think this season, Chelsea will emerge. So if I come on with with my prediction already, my new, let's see, Arsenal, Man City, I love Chelsea, I love Man U. I think those are the really top four they will emerge. Mambo itachamuka huku. Ah, sapia kuna boy wangu mwingine aitwa Mike. Mike wangu fulani na kongo kwa hivyo mbasani mse anapenda Liverpool to the core pia ile muza top 4 yake ni gani na kwa nini and Mike is a serious analyst nataka msikie feedback yake hapa hivi eh 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 sasa uh, uh, ligi inaanza hii weekend na ukiniona hapa nimejipanga na jazi kali sana ya Liverpool hii ni away jazi ni jazi kali sana na round hii kila timu wamejipanga hapo top 4 kila mtu amejipanga eh? kila mtu ameongeza kitu kwa squad waangalie Arsenal wameongeza Rice pale waangalie Arsenal tena wameweka wame, wame timba so utaona by the so many people walikuwa wanasema eti Arsenal wangeuza pate and i kept on saying hakuna mahali pate anaenda because plan ya ateta at, at, ni kuchezesha uh, DMs wawili that is uh, ataika Rice ataka rais na timba wacheze pamoja so itakuwa midfield nyingine kali sana uh, ukiangalia liverpool shida yetu sana last season ilikuwa mambo na midfield uh, tukaongeza players wawili pale zobosli uh, zobo tukaongeza mcallister so 
tuna expect hiyo mid ikuwe kali sana watu wanasema oh you go guys you need a dm uh, we always trust our manager na tunajua pale liverpool uh, situation yote tu yani solution itatokea so to sign dm ama tusipo sign dm yani sisi tuko tu sawa tuliongeza watu wawili that is uh, zoboslai na makalista so tuko tu hapo alafu ukiangalia man city man city pale wameongeza players wengine pia wawili sana wawili wa, wa, wazuri sana mmoja anaitwa Josko uh, Gavadiol alafu mwingine anaitwa Kovacic Kovacic alikuwa Chelsea ukiangalia Kovacic is going to play a key role in that Manchester uh, City uh, squad and moving forward Gadiola pia atacheza DMs wawili na Kovacic atakuwa one of them na itakuwa midfield ingine pia matata sana uh, Manu pale wameongeza striker uh, wameongeza striker anaitwa Rasmus so tuna believe watakuwa wamejaribu kusort hiyo issue yao ya ya strike so top 4 prediction hapa ndio sasa kuna mambo so uh, this season naona man city bando wana win league because uh, wako na experience uh, ukiangalia squad yote wako na watu wako na experience ku, ku win the league and then tena wameongeza watu kwa squad watu wako na experience tena uh, mtu kama covasi chamecheza world cup finals ni mtu wako na experience sana ku win games so uh, still naona hii season itaenda tu kwa man city number two, naona liverpool wakichukua because round hii uh, hawachezi games mingi in as much as watacheza europa watacheza games mingi so wameongeza pia watu kwa squad and then europa si kitu ina demand sana kama champions league najua watu wangesema it arsenal Um, wanaweza kuwa namba 2 ama wanaweza win league uh, Arsenal fans bado I'm sorry to tell you this bado amta win league na mtamaliza number 3 reasons number 1 bado you have a very young squad inexperienced squad mnaenda kucheza Champions League and there are several cups uh, Arsenal inatakana pia wacheze so number 1 itakuwa Man City my prediction number 2 itakuwa Liverpool number 3 itakuwa Arsenal alafu Man U itakuwa number 4 Uh, shida ya Manu pia ni moja because they are think, uh, bado wanajaribu jaribu ku uh, change squad yao wanajaribu ku fix squad here and here and there at least uh, uh, vitu zianze ku work out but Manchester United squad bado inataka kazi mingi sana uh, juzi niliona goalkeeper wenu alikuwa chipped watu wa Manu alafu mkaanza kusema oh nana si goalkeeper mzuri i want to tell you one thing Manchester United you have the best one of the best goalkeepers in the world and um, ni goalkeepers wazuri wazuri ndio wamekuwa chipped ukiona noya amekuwa chipped mara mingi sana but he is one of the best german goalkeepers that we ever, we've, we've ever seen so mkae mkijua nyinyi mlipata kipa mzuri mpatie time a settle nikipa anajin involve kwa play nikipa distribution ball distribution yake iko juu and hiyo ndio vitu degea kwa nayo and that is why uh, ten wenu aliamua uh, ule ule kipa wenu aende asikae so uh, that is my top four prediction na wacha tuone vile ligi itaenda aya prediction zangu za premier league matches this weekend i think nita choose kadha ama nita choose the key ones alafu tutaona venye zitaenda ama vipi So ndaza na Arsenal obviously Arsenal ndaza na Nottingham Forest na pati Arsenal hapo hivyo 2 nil clean eh yeah, i think uh, watanza hiyo game na moto ndo pati ya 2 nil City wanaenda kuza na Burnley na obviously company ndo coaches wa Burnley so anacheza na mse eh alim coach for some time pia but i think haitakuwa rahisi i know Burnley will score cause ni game ya first wa the Premier League but i still think City watakuwa very strong aya ka 3-1. Ah, uh, game nyingine yenye naangalia ni Everton versus Fulham, very interesting. Mid table game hapo hivyo. Eh, na aya ka 2-2 hiyo game. I think kutakuwa na mabao kadhaa zitafungwa hapo hivyo. Aston Villa na Newcastle, uh, Newcastle obviously season wako na point ya kuprove. Alafu una Emery pia ako na point ya kuprove, lakini I think Newcastle watashinda hiyo 2-1. Uh, United watch the Wolves I think on Monday. Uh, easy win for United na yeka 3-1. Alafu Chelsea watch the Liverpool game of the weekend. 
I think that would be a very interesting game to watch. Because Chelsea wanna match all the talents they bought, Liverpool wanna rebuild. I'm calling it a two two for that game. No no predictions are analyst from Tajafo for the Premier League week one matches. Where are Konigani? Tafadali to ambia by me down. I'm a VP. Yeah. Be on the show, yeah, wiki, our first show of the season to me and Zaivo that now hope it can impact to the review is or results then uh, next week to one even as me and now to now hope to subscribe and as you could follow that to build analyst on top of more jama vp where we come analyst bonga na sisi we easy pages z to up ivy to appreciate sana to zd who analyze pamoja our vp next time but then